Vanilla, uh, salt, chocolate chips, this, uh, I don't know, it's measured in cups, and then we have butter, then we have brown sugar and eggs. Uh, we have a mixer, we have two bowls. sugar into this bowl then we pour in the brown sugar looks like kinetic sand <laughs> then we crack the eggs in this bowl so There's a tip if there's any shells. Um, you need to put them in a different bowl because if there's any shells, then like it might get some shells in there just in case if you want. Any shells? Oh, there's one there. This one. Get it out. Okay, I think we got it out. It definitely got a big one there. Big one. Okay, now we dump this one in to there. Into there. Yeah, it got some of it. So then, see ya in the next step. Mix it up. Put that one first. Then Doesn't matter where you put it. Then we are going to see you in the next step. The next step is to put in the chocolate chips, but make sure to 
mix it fast and put in the chocolate chips. We usually we use organic chocolate chips, so it's better. Then we're just gonna dump it all in. to like the dough in my chocolate chips. See in the next step we're gonna make the little dough balls then we're gonna put them in the oven. So you need about this much but then you just grab it then you make it into a ball. You need I think a little more. Then you make it into a ball. Then you kind of flatten it. Then you just put it on the pan. Okay. Then just keep making them into little balls then put them in the oven then they'll make cookies cookies okay now we got the dough balls and you usually need to put them like little apart so they don't mix in together then we're going to put them in the oven see you next time okay the cookies are done and now you just need to wait like 15 or 20 minutes for them to cool down after like when it cools down, we're gonna do the taste test. And I've made these cookies before and they they like crunch on the outside and then like like soft in the inside and it's like really good. So we're gonna taste test, see if it is good. And I think it will be good. And See you in taste this test. This is the taste test. They're done. And you can see right there. Then I'm gonna taste them. I can feel the crunch on the outside and then the soft in the inside. So let's taste them. Mm. tastes really good because it's like the crunch is like a little soft and then it's like soft in the inside and then it melted chocolate chips and that would be the end of Cal Duper Fun Time and we'll put the ingredient in the description and see you in the next video next video bye this is Kel from Kel Super Fun Time, and today we are going to make Kel's cookies. So first we have flour, big, big flour, I have sugar, baking soda, vanilla, salt, chocolate chips, this, I don't know, it's measured in cups, and then we have butter. Then we have brown sugar and eggs. And then we have a mixer. We have two bowls. Then we have these, which go on to this. Then we have these spoons.
ingredients. So we get the sugar. We're pouring the sugar into this bowl. Then we pour in the brown sugar. Looks like kinetic sand. <laughs> then we crack the eggs in this bowl. So, down, down. And there's a tip if there's any shells. Um, you need to put them in a different bowl because if there's any shells, then like it might get some shells in there just in case if you want. Any shells? Oh, there's one there. Let's see. Let's get Get it out. Okay, I think we got it out. Yeah. So then we dump. I definitely got a big one there. Big one. Okay, now we dump this one in to there. <laughs> Into there. Yeah, I got some of it. So then, see you in the next step. Mix it up for that one first, then Doesn't matter where you put it. Then we are going to see you in the next step. Okay, next step we're gonna put the flour. I think. Okay, I'm done yeah. looking at flour. And now it's time to pour the dry ingredients. Here's the dry ingredients into the wet. So we do that. We pour it in like that. Then in the next step we are gonna put the chocolate chips in this in that bowl. Then we're gonna mix it up. See you in the next step. The next step is to put in the chocolate chip but make sure to mix it first. Then from the chocolate chips, we usually we use organic chocolate chips, so it's better. Then we're just gonna dump it all in. Now the oven. I don't know the oven. Uh, the oven is preheated. 
Then you're gonna put this into the oven when you make the salsa with the dough and like chopped chips. See in the next step. So you need about this much, but then you just grab it, then you make it into a ball, you need about I think a little more, then you make it into a ball, then you kind of flatten it. Then you just put it on the pan. Okay. Then just keep making them into little balls. Then put them in the oven. Then they'll make cookies. Cookies. Okay, we just. to like put them in there because it's really hot and you can see in there right now because they have a light then we're gonna wait like five minutes and then put it at 375 degrees then we're gonna wait five minutes and then we're gonna check When it cools down, we're gonna do the taste test. And I've made these cookies before, and they they like crunch on the outside, and then like like soft in the inside, and it's like really good. So we're gonna taste test see if it is good, and I think it will be good. And See you in taste so this test. This is the taste test. They're done. And you can see right there. Then I'm going to taste them. I can feel the crunch on the outside and then the soft in the inside. So let's taste them. tastes really good but it's like the crunch is like a little soft and then it's like soft in the inside and then melted chocolate chips and that would be the end of Kel Super Fun Time and we'll put the ingredient in the description and see you in the next video next video bye